Winter wind whistles through the forests and skims the snowy fields of Geauga Park District. Strap on some snowshoes, launch a sled, or simply take a hike to experience Geauga County's seasonal beauty. Winter adventures begin at geaugaparkdistrict.org. Cardinal Softball here with Junior Elena Rupinski and Senior Kelsey Collins. First and foremost, what are your guys' goals for this season? What are some of the obstacles that you guys are looking to overcome? Um, definitely getting three outs like right away instead of like putting our pitchers like under a bad situation where all the pressure's on them, which would send mentally and it's not good for their arm. So that would be good. I definitely think our attitudes you guys have some strong underclassmen coming in, um, including pitchers Maggie Grant and Dakota Gillespie. What are they able to provide for your team? Um, the, all of the new underclassmen are all very strong-minded, and they all have a great work ethic, and they're just overall great players and teammates, and they're all very coachable, and I just, we're very glad that they came up this year. I think with the underclassmen, too, um, they compete really well and they're competitive. So Elena, how is that going to push the upperclassmen and even um, the freshmen and sophomores coming in? I definitely think it's going to help us to like fight for our spot more and fight for where we want to play. Not in like the mean way or anything, but just we're, I think we're all going to uplift each other in a way that we all improve as a group rather than individual. Um, the last couple of seasons for conference play have been kind of tough. So who are some of the teams that maybe you have circled on your calendar that you're looking to get some revenge on? What do you guys need to do in order to beat those uh, teams? And just um, looking back, um, how you guys played them last year, what were things that you're looking to improve on? Um, our hitting, we need to get the bat swinging, and also, once again, getting the three outs right away. Elena, any final thoughts? I think being coherent as well. And I definitely think in the past, when we have been losing, we have gotten very discouraged. So I think working on that. I'm going to give you guys one more, too. We didn't have a girls' basketball season this past winter. Um, so what does it mean for you guys, especially you, Kelsey, being a senior? We've gone the last couple of seasons with 10, 11 girls, and this year our numbers have increased to 17, 18. What does that do for the program? I think it's, like, really, like, it brings such a good feeling because, like, I feel like in years past, girls have always felt like, you know, like, this is it. We're it. Like, they had to put so much pressure on themselves because there was nobody else. And, like, now there is, and there's more people to influence and leave something behind you, and there's more there to share the heavy mental part of the game. All right, good luck this season, ladies.